YouTube and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. So it is currently 7.15 on a Tuesday night. I feel like every time I record for YouTube, I always tell y'all what day it is or 10 minutes. But I guess I'm supposed to do whatever. But, but it's currently Tuesday night and I'm cooking. I just got out the shower and tonight I'm cooking steak potatoes and garlic bread um i think i want to put corn on the cob but i don't really know so right now i'm only cooking steak potatoes and garlic bread per carter's request so earlier i went to the grocery store because i actually needed to badly i went to the grocery store and i haven't cooked steak in a while but carter have been steady asking me like mom can we cook steak can we get steak and um when I was there, I'm like, I'm gonna cook steak tonight. And I picked him up to school and I told him, he's like, oh, tonight's gonna be a fancy little night. And I guess it is. So I got my little, um, my little candle spoon, you know, little set up. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I just got out the shower. My potatoes, my baked potatoes are already in the oven. I put them in there before I got in the shower. I'm gonna, Put me some ice water in this cup. My cousin Bam, my favorite cousin, the Hawaii girl, Bam. She may need this cup. Y'all see? It says Aries 419. My birthday. And it's super, super cute. And I love it so bad. Carter loves it too. He cannot stop using it. But yeah, I'm gonna make me some ice water real quick. Hold on. We're gonna do a little. Oh. We're gonna do a little ASMR for y'all. And I don't even know how to clean this because my type of clean is clean. about a whole bottle of water. I probably got too much ice. Ooh, wait. Oh, wait. I had to break my ice up so my cup can fit. It, it keeps it super, super cold. And it just makes the water so much better. Get you one. Get you one. But yeah, y'all, oh. My steaks have been marinating for a little while. Wait, hold on, let me show y'all. I just have them marinating in my seasonings and then I use the Kikomen, the Kikomen soy sauce. Yeah. Yeah. Which I'm not bad at. Yeah, what y'all know about that? <laughs> I y'all, uh, I didn't know what I was gonna do. This is, I didn't know what I was gonna um. what I was gonna talk about while I cook. So I made a post on Instagram and told, Vinny coming down to see us of course. I made a post on Instagram and told them to ask me some questions so that I can answer questions while I cook. Cause I didn't just wanna cook, you know? So yeah, we're gonna do that, but first I'm gonna get started. Um, this is, the skillet that I'm going to be cooking my steak in. Let me rinse her out. Um, I'm gonna heat my skillet up and toss some butter in here. Me 
personally, me personally. <laughs> No pink, like it can be a small incy beansy, but I don't like no pink for the most part. Like I just can't, like I just can't. I don't like it. Oh, should I bring y'all over here? Should I bring you guys over here? I don't like the lighting up here. So my pan is heated. Let me show y'all. So that butter. I'm gonna get a steak from out of there. I feel like I'm almost everything. I haven't made steak in months, literally. She would have answered. Like, cook. Mom, I'm cooking steak. How long do I let it cook on each side? steak? Yeah, I'm cooking ribeye steak. How long do I let it cook on each side? You cook it in the what? Real Kill it on the stove. I'm cooking it on the stove, Mom. Mom, how long will it
Let me check on my book. Hey. because I don't know what I did, but my last like two vlogs been like real bad. So before I did this video, I played with the settings. I feel like it looks better, but y'all see I'm still looking at it because yeah, it seemed like it's getting dark and then it's not. But let me show y'all, I hope. Again, I like my steak well done. It's not burnt, but it is well done. You don't want one. Yeah. You want me to cut your steak up? 
You want me to cut it? Yeah. No, all the honey gave me a big piece. If you don't eat it, I'll okay to save it. No. I'm not going to save it. Eat it all. Oh, yeah, I'm cutting part of steak up. Yup. Yup. Yo, 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 yo. Yeah, I was. I initially fixed our plate. I wanted to be here. Well, I started to fix our plate. Here go the A1 sauce right here. <laughs> yeah, look at Raheem's plate. This is Raheem's plate. Oh, that was your plate. Raheem got the whole menu. This is my plate. Oh, y'all. I, I already told y'all my, my um camera ended up dying, so I'm gonna... Answer the questions while no, I ask Instagram asking questions. Well, I'm gonna put it right here so you can dip it. Mm -hmm. Mom, can I answer questions? Is this one here? No. Because it's not still questions. Oh. Oh, it's them questions. Them grown up questions? Yeah, grown up questions. Can you give me a bottle of water? Okay. Go on. So I'm going to refill my cup because I drank it out and as you can see my ice is still in there. Hey bro, shout out to Ben bro. <laughs> shout out to Ben. Her name is Dan Ben on Instagram. Yeah. That's just made me think about Kodak Black. This is not my buddy. This is fake buddy. <laughs> But whatever. <laughs> I'm gonna get the hard part, baby. Okay. Did you tell Raheem to come eat? He heard you already. This is the water. Raheem! Yeah. Come eat your food. Please. I'm gonna try to get him out. Uh -uh. Raheem. No, we forgot to do the interview with Raheem. Come on, ain't that that thing? What kind of thing? Bussy. Why don't I let me taste some of the potatoes? Why? 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 What is it with him? But he don't. I'm actually gonna cut my steak up too. Everybody cut their steak up. Well, I'm gonna just take the knife upstairs with me. Tell me a little A1 sauce. A1 sauce. How to make it on? Raheem and his bonnet. Bruh. Eat, eat, ugly. <laughs> Y'all, so I'm about to go upstairs and then I'll come back in. You <laughs> should record me do an ASMR I, um, eating. Why you should do an ASMR eating when I come back down? I mean, ASMR. when I get upstairs, I'm gonna just take the first bite though. Is mm -hmm. it busting? I'm gonna eat so kind of thinking on some. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's so hard to bite. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so my light bulb in my room below. The one, because I got two. The one in my bedroom, well, over my bed. It's out. So I had to sit it on my dresser. On my lights down. Should I get a little light? Okay. Oh, I was already answering a question. So as I was saying, I have never I've always said that I wanted to go to Africa, but I was never like in a rush to go to Africa because I know the pain ride is so long. But Africa is so beautiful. 
and one of my instagram followers just went to africa for her birthday courtney and When I tell you, beautiful. Like, it was so beautiful. I literally dipped through her on that trip. And I, if I saw, I'm like, you just made me want to go to Africa. Like, it was just so beautiful. It just gave me, like, so peaceful and just, you know, just, I don't know. It just made me feel some type of way. And I was like, oh yeah, I gotta go to Africa. So, Africa is one of the places I really want to visit in um, 2024. So, and as you guys know, I will be turning 30 next year on my birthday. So, who knows? I might be turning 30 in Africa. And I'm only going to answer like four questions, four or five questions. Because I don't want to make it long. Somebody said, can you and India do more videos together? Of course. That's my best friend. Why not? So, we probably got something coming. Who knows? Y'all just gotta stay tuned, subscribe, turn y'all post notifications on, and maybe y'all got a surprise for y'all. Who knows? Y'all. <laughs> My last video. I made me talking. And I was eating that pat pat. So many people was like, girl, <laughs> you messed that chicken up. Like, you was really, like, they like, you you barely was trying to talk. You made sure you ate all your food first. Like, I'm the type of person that I can't eat and talk. Because my priority is eating my food. Like, I like my food a certain temperature. And I like to eat my food, so I'm not gonna be right there trying to talk for the video, letting my food get cold or like nah. And I'm not gonna be up on here trying to be cute to eat or uh, none of that. Like I get down, so that's this just what I do. Oh no, and y'all. I really, 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 really just want to say I appreciate, like, from the bottom of my heart, like, I'm going to be real serious right now because I know I play a lot, but I really mean this from the bottom of my heart. Like, I really, 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 really appreciate everybody that took the time out to comment first of all to watch my video my if you didn't go watch it it's the video of me where i was venting and i just really appreciate and thank everybody that took the time out to watch my video and you know respond and leave um comment just letting me know how y'all feel and just letting me know it's gonna be okay and just letting me know that i'm not alone like it really 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 felt good to know that i'm not alone it really felt good to read some of y'all's comments and you know just know that you guys are with me that you support me and that you love me so much and that you wish me well like reading those comments like i was literally in tears like i love y'all so much I did not know y'all was behind me like that. Like, thank you guys so much for letting me know that y'all are here with me and that I am not alone. Like, I really do appreciate that. Like, that really made me feel some type of way because 
I feel like I feel like I be on YouTube and I got people on here on Instagram and on YouTube that you know be like they they fuck with me or whatever, but that really just you know show me a different side and it just show me like why I do what I do and that I really need to stay consistent and that y'all really mess with me because I just always felt like YouTube was something for me to do. Like I never took it serious as y'all can see I post a video like once every three months but lately I've been consistent. And that just made me really want to go harder for y'all. That, that just made me really want to stick around and that just motivated me like you know. So yeah. I have a lot in store for y'all 2024. I'm coming with it, okay? And I also been trying my best, like really, really trying my best to stay on social media. I completely deleted Facebook and um Twitter. I have not been on there at all. Instagram, I deleted it and I added back. I deleted it and I added back. It's just so hard for me to just fully go cold turkey on Instagram, but... I'm getting there, you know, slowly but surely, I'm getting there, but I've been doing so good, I've been staying productive, you know, like, I just been, I have not been, I have not been being a lazy bitch, okay, I haven't, I've been up, and I've been doing stuff, and I'm proud of that, you know, baby steps. Baby steps. Um, oh, I'm going to answer one more question. She said, so somebody, she said, can you give me advice on relationships? And then I was like, what can, like, can you be a little more specific or just period? She said, um, like, trust, boundaries. I'm in a long distance relationship, so I'm interested in your thoughts. I just feel like when you first start out in that relationship, you know, y'all gotta build first. And if y'all decide, like, okay, this is what I wanna do, I wanna be with you, you wanna be with me, so we're together now. I feel like if that person have not gave you a reason not to trust them, then you should go into the situation. You know, trusting them. I feel like we all got it in our head these days that I don't trust nobody. All men cheat and men feel like all women cheat. But I just feel like if you with somebody and you like, okay, I love you and I'm with you. And you have not gave me any reasons to feel like you're being disloyal. You behind my back then. I'm going to trust you until you make me feel like I can't trust you. And as far as boundaries, I feel like you need to let that person know what your boundaries are in the door because people will try to overstep like let a person know like look this is what i like this is what i don't like like and even if y'all don't talk about it prior and somebody do something and you feel a way like i feel like speak up don't just sweep it under the rug and see if they're gonna do it again or expect for them to know what they did wrong because i feel like that's my problem i always feel like you knew that that was wrong. You knew that it make me feel some type of way. But we got to think about it too. Like men mess with women previously. And that woman probably allowed him to do these type of things. So she didn't give him a problem. You know like she didn't feel no type of way about it. So he feel like in the next relationship. Oh I could probably do this too. And she won't. No. I don't move how the next person moves. So you know speak up let a person know like oh i don't like this or you did this to make me feel it like but definitely have your boundaries don't don't change them for nobody don't you know dumb nothing down like stand on your shit okay stand on it and i feel like long distance relationships for me like i recently got into a long distance long distance relationship and it wasn't bad like well it's not bad <laughs> It's not bad, like, you know, you have your days where you where you miss them and you want to be, but it's like, 
well i don't know y'all situation but for me like it was nothing to it's nothing for me to go there or for him to come here you know so i feel like it's not that it just depends on y'all throughout the days or throughout the week like if y'all constantly talking facetiming you know like then it should be good like if he's not giving you reasons to feel like oh he's out doing other things that he shouldn't be doing then i feel like you know just go with it just go with the flow just trust him until he give you a reason not to i don't know if it sounds like i'm all over the place but yeah i just feel like you should just let it you know if you're happy be happy if he's not giving you no reasons to feel like he's cheating on you or he's doing anything sticky behind your back then girl love your man like be in your soft girl era and love your man okay because it's so much going on in this world like you here one day and you gone the next like literally so love on your man girl love on your neck okay <laughs> but y'all i don't know how long this video is but i think i'll make it just this one video um i go out of town this weekend so tomorrow I'm going tomorrow I'm going to get my lashes done then on Thursday I'm going to get my hair done then I leave Friday um I have not packed nothing because I've been waiting on packages that that's delayed in transit well it's only one that's delayed then i had ordered this cute dress that's supposed to come tomorrow so my fingers are crossed that it does come tomorrow my dress is delayed in transit it's supposed to came yesterday did it come yesterday didn't come today so hopefully it comes at least by thursday if not then i'm gonna have to find something else but yeah that's why i haven't packed because i at least want to wait to see if my stuff comes just in case I have to go to the mall. Um yeah, so that's that. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um I really do love and appreciate each and every one of you. And it's like it's so crazy because I was just looking at my analytics on YouTube and I'm like being consistent on youtube really matters like it really matters like every day i see my subscribers growing every time i drop a video i see my views growing in lesser days you know because that type of stuff will really get you down like dang ain't nobody subscribing dang ain't nobody watching my videos but the key to growing your youtube is staying consistent and i'm really starting to see that that's why i'm making this video for y'all right now so yeah you guys are definitely going to see more of me thank you guys so 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 much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend to come watch me <laughs> bye bye <gasps> ah! hey what they said i'm a dog in this true baby <laughs>